We're in for a big change across Central Virginia overnight and a tale of two seasons this weekend. Today it was more like spring. Tomorrow will definitely feel like winter once again. Cold front sliding to the south of us. We got some rain that is going to change to snow later on tonight in areas north and west Fredericksburg to Charlottesville. Folks up that way will likely see snow before daybreak and then eventually this precipitation slides into the metro area. We're thinking rounds of snow showers mid to late morning into the afternoon as well and those snow showers could coat the ground in spots. 50 degrees still outside right now. The wind has turned to the north at seven miles an hour. As I mentioned, the colder air starting to filter in and by daybreak, I expect temperatures to be in the mid and upper 30s, lower 30s to the northwest. So in this region, we're probably going to see a little bit of snow accumulate by sunrise tomorrow morning. And these are the highs tomorrow. So we don't move. We only go down a little bit during the day here in the metro area as the cold air settles in. It really deepens tomorrow night night. So anything that falls, if it leaves some liquid on the ground, will freeze tomorrow night and there could be some icy spots going into Monday morning as well. So here's how we see things playing out. Some showers developing already to our west. Charlottesville seeing a little bit of rain now. The rain will break out in Louisa County, Hanover County, Caroline over the next hour or two. It will start to shift very slowly to the east, but mainly turn to snow to the west. This may be a little underdone in terms of precipitation closer to the metro by 6 a.m. We may see some rain showers that then turn to snow showers as we go through the morning. You can see at midday still has a hard time making its way farther to the east, but eventually it will. This is the area of concern for some accumulation, although we'll likely see a coating in some places as the snow showers go into the afternoon hours here. By 5 o'clock, most of this pushing to the southeast, but there's another little disturbance that will kick through in the evening and that may create a few more snow showers and flurries. It's all gone Monday morning, but there will be some icy spots. The sun will be back out and temperatures will be in the 30s for Valentine's Day, but then warming up during the course of the coming week. So here's how things uh, play out in terms of potential accumulations, and this is probably the worst case scenario in the metro up to an inch in a few locations. That's mainly grassy surfaces, decks and cars. It's really northwest where we'll see some of this accumulation an inch or two from Fredericksburg down through much of Louisa and farther south to Buckingham County and then two to three inches Charlottesville up to Orange and Culpeper. And there's a winter storm warning up in the higher elevations out west where they could see more along the I-81 corridor south and east very little a coating to maybe a half an inch. So it's cold tomorrow. It stays cold on Monday, but look at the temperatures. Jake mentioned some weather whiplash this week, going back up near 70 by the time we get to Thursday. Overnight tonight gradually gets colder. We're in the 30s by daybreak. Showers develop some snow to the northwest later on. Most of the snow in the metro will come mid to late morning into the afternoon hours. Our temperatures stay in the 30s. It's all gone tomorrow night, but watch for icy spots for those of you heading out for the Super Bowl. And then Monday morning for Valentine's Day, watch for a few slick spots. We're in the upper 30s. Then it warms up, stays dry through Wednesday. Some showers with another system later in the week and gusts. Steep winds.